The holiday season is a time when people give to others, but it's also a time when scammers look to take from others. Cyber Grinches working extra hours to swindle shoppers out of money. Scammers, they have no shame. Many of us are wrapped up in our last minute shopping surges, but that doesn't mean risk aren't lurking. Scammers follow the headlines. That is what they do because they know it's on the top of people's minds. So right now they know people are buying gifts. One of their most common methods of scamming, gift cards. One of the biggest red flags is, you know, when they want you to uh, make a donation or make a payment with some type of iTunes or some type of, of prepaid card. Bailey Parker with the Department of Consumer Affairs explained why scammers prefer gift cards. It's like cash. Once you give that scammer the gift card information, it's theirs. You're not going to see that money. The BBB and SCDCA say people of all ages must be aware because scammers target everyone. It's a common misconception that older adults are most often the victim of scams. Uh, studies are showing and numbers are showing that millennials are actually the ones that are getting scammed more often. Parker says the best way to prevent falling victim to a scam is to be proactive. Be your number one advocate. Call the companies you work for, the banks you work for. Ask them what they're doing to keep your information safe. The Better Business Bureau and the South Carolina Department of Consumer Affairs have multiple resources online talking about scams. They also wanted to remind shoppers that if something sounds too good to be true, it probably is. Reporting in Mount Pleasant, Kevon Dupree, Count On Two.